that was that was totally unexpected i was <laughs> i was not expecting what's up scott and there's ozella we're gonna watch ozella ozella has been going in the woods we almost positive she's got a nest in the woods there she goes i don't want her to see me she's right there there she goes can y'all see her she's right there and she's walking in the woods let's see if i can follow her without her seeing me she's right over there If I can at least get a general idea where she's going. Maybe she's not going too far, so I'm hoping. Man, she is really going. She's right over there. A lot further than what I thought. She's definitely got a nest. Just finding it is going to be the thing. You can see our chickens come in here and scratch around in the woods. They love being in these woods. I have totally lost her now. No idea where she went. Oh, I heard her. Did y'all hear her? She sees me again. She went this way, but now she's over here. Here, tooting, honking. All right, she's in this direction. All right, let's go see. She knows I'm here. The thing is, I gotta watch out for snakes. I, she's not moving. She's in the same spot. Ugh. I hate all these down pine trees. That creek's right over there. I can go around this way. Let's see. Now, if she's laying down, she's gonna be tough to see. I don't see any visual of her whatsoever. But it sounded like she was right in here. a little trail she comes in the mornings and gets something to eat and then she goes back in the woods and she's been doing this for a week now y'all can see how thick this forest is <laughs> finding her is not going to be easy <clears throat> and she may have kept moving she may have kept moving. The only thing I'm worried about is a predator finding her and her eggs. I know she's sitting. That's all I worry about. We don't care if she hatched them out. Just worried about if something gets to her. I've totally lost her. No, there she is. She's right there. Gosh, she was so camouflaged. I don't know what to do. Cause she's deep in these woods. We have possums, raccoons, foxes. That's why we got our two livestock guardian dogs. And you know why everything is kind of fenced in. 
Huh. But then again, I don't want to take them from her either. So it's, um, just don't know what to do. I would like to see how many eggs she's actually got. Hey, baby. Hey, Rosella. How many eggs you got, girl? Huh? How many eggs you got? All right, she got up. She's got five eggs. I'm going to take two and leave her three. And maybe that'll ensure that we'll get a, um, we'll get some chicks. And that way we can raise them. All right, girl. There you go. All right, we got two eggs. Left her three. Now I got to get back to the house. Boy, we were, she's deep in there. Deep in there. Go back this way. I mean, look at this. She's got a good spot. I just hope nothing happens to her. Hope I can get out of here without seeing a snake or a yellow jacket nest. I cannot believe I found her. That's crazy. I'm, I'm happy. We knew that she'd been going in the woods. But it didn't know how far she'd been going. She was a pretty good little ways. I'd say at least 100 yards in there. It's pretty thick back up in there. This area had been clear-cutted many, 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 many years ago. Before we were here. And so it's kind of thick. Y'all can see how the chickens love coming in the woods here. Love it. Come here, Carl. Look what I got. Ozella eggs. Where are they? Way up in the woods. I followed her. She's got a nest. She had five, but I only took two. I'm going to leave her to three. Be careful with her now because we can't get any more. Let's go read about what temperature and all that and get them in the incubator, okay? <laughs> Whew. I would say high five, but you won't drop the egg. <laughs> Scott? Scott? Your girl is over there in the woods, but you worried about dadgum popcorn. All right, go, go. That's popcorn. <laughs> that wind almost blew him down. <laughs> All right, let's go get these eggs up to the house. Mama, guess what we got? Yeah. Two. Five. Only five total? Five total. Oh, they're forming. So they are fertile. Both yeah. of them. There we go. For your spare eggs. All right, 99 degrees and 60% humidity, or 100 degrees, 60% humidity. So let's set our humidity. Is it? Uh, to 60 yeah. and it said 100 degrees. Yes, yeah, 99. All right. It turns. You have to put it, down it is turned every hour. So it's set to turn every hour. So we'll see what happens. Freaking Scott's going to be a proud daddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Billy Rubs are the best. Yeah. Big Thomas. What do you think about having some baby peacocks running around? Be a little bit more work for you to, you know, keep up with, but I don't know. I guess we'll see, right? All right, we're gonna move the, uh, we're gonna move the turkey lurkeys. You know, we got them set up in this dog kennel right now until the guy comes in and straightens out our land work that needs to be done. We're free. What's up, Vanilla Ice? Freckles? That was the one last. I'm coming, Joe? Who? Huh? One of them, Joe. I you said goat. Joe. Joe, oh, Freckles, and Vanilla Ice. Let's go that way. Go that way. There you go. All right. Come on, turkey. Come on. 
Go, 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 go. Y'all keep going. Come on. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Go here, everybody. Come on. Go, 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 go. We're feeding them game bird feed, right? Game bird starter. Got a higher percentage of protein, which is what they need. Gotcha. And we we're just discussing about putting them in the tip and top goat pen because it's empty. And we decided that the ducks would get in there and eat all the game bird feed. Yeah, we don't want that. No. I don't want that at all. I want to see the snowy mallards since they're getting bigger. Yeah. Are they over here? Yep. This is where the this is where the ducks like to hang out over in this swampy area right over here. I mean, this is the duck hangout over here. Oh, there's the snowy mallards. God, they're beautiful. Yeah, I think there's a crested pin. I mean, they are beautiful. That's that's one and that's one. I just love them. They are beautiful ducks. Yeah. And those are runners. Those are Indian runners behind them. See how they look like bowling pins, how they stand straight up. Yeah, those snowy mallards are beautiful. And that's a regular mallard in front there, yeah. but she's got a little boof on her head. And that one in the back is a regular mallard. Okay, yeah, that's a female mallard right there. Awesome. They love that little mud puddle by that. Yeah, they love this area over here, which I'm kind of glad. I like this area for them. You can see the, the lizard tail over here. This is real... This, this whole area is really, really wet. This lizard tail loves swampy areas. It's a beautiful uh, flower. I think it's really cool. Chief, did you hear about the peacock eggs, man? Yeah, they're probably going to be peacock chick chicks running around here for too long. Yep. I'm sure you can handle it, though. You handle watching all over these hens. I'm sure you can handle a couple peacock chicks. And if not, Thomas will help you out. All right, so this really isn't a true test yet if the nesting box is new. The new nesting box is working properly. It's only been really, so this will be really the first full day. And I'll do an update on it. There's a, a little neck and neck in here, but one egg. <laughs> one egg in here, three in there. None in there. Cotton. And because we're fixing to go look over there in the goat pen and see how many are in there. How many is in there? How many is in here? Oh, there's none on the ground. Oh, none on the ground? Mm -hmm. So they didn't lay none in here? Uh -huh. Oh, here's one. I got one. Here you go. Really, Chip? Just one. And there's a crap one down there. Huh. Now where did I lay in? So that's odd. We only had two in the goat pen. Swing was a good idea. Swing was a great idea. What do you think, Thomas? I bet you swing down here when we're not here. You just show out all the time. All the time. Boozy said when you're pregnant, you just gotta lay around. Girl, believe me, I know. <laughs> I laid around for nine straight months. <laughs> hey guys, if you missed that video where we got Ozella and took her to Lowe's, check out that video right over here. If you're new to the channel, like what you see, hit that subscribe button. And if you're interested in any Cock Hill Farm merchandise like our hats, our shirts, and now our stickers, check out that link right down below me. Y'all be good. Mm -hmm.